As a pensioner, what are your rights if you move to another EU country? Thinking of moving to another country of the European Union? What will happen to your pension and healthcare coverage if you're receiving a state pension from one or more EU countries? Well, thanks to European Union rules, you can move to any EU country plus Iceland, Liechtenstein, Norway or Switzerland and carry on receiving the entire amount of your state pension there. Take Marta, for example. She's Irish and has decided to retire in Portugal. Marta receives a state pension from Ireland. Living in Portugal, Marta continues to receive her pension there. Remember, wherever you have worked in the EU, you will carry on receiving your pension if you move to another EU country. If you have worked in more than one EU country, you will carry on receiving pensions from each of these countries. But what about healthcare? If you decide to live in a country which is also paying one of your pensions, whatever the amount, this country will generally be responsible for your healthcare coverage. As it is, Marta is enjoying her retirement in Portugal, which isn't, however, paying her a pension. Her healthcare coverage is therefore ensured by the country which pays her pension, Ireland. But Marta can still access healthcare in Portugal under the same conditions as people insured there. That's because she asked her Irish healthcare authority for an S1 form, which she used to register for healthcare cover with the Portuguese authorities. Behind the scenes, Ireland reimburses Portugal for the healthcare provided on its behalf. Ireland is also responsible for issuing Marta with a European health insurance card, which she can use for medically necessary healthcare when travelling in the EU. Thanks to EU Social Security coordination, you can move freely around Europe and not lose out on your Social Security rights. Social Security coordination. Europe is your playground. <laughs>